prepare for another chill review. Hello everyone, T-Man978. Right now I'm going to be bringing you a super close look at Zero Suit Samus Amiibo from the Smash Brothers Edition Wave. This is part of the Wave 5 Amiibo. And she's a general release so you can find her in any store. There were a lot in the stores that I went to so I'm not sure if you might still be able to get some. But one thing to take note of is she has a mole on her chin. I think they gave her that during other M or it might have been beforehand. But when I seen a little speck on her her cheek on the actual amiibo, I thought it was an imperfection. But <laughs> she does actually have a mole on her chin. Let's see if we can see who her opponent is. No, they just show her kicking. So she's one of the few amiibo that doesn't have an opponent on the back. But let's get her out of the box. And so I keep the packaging. Here it is without her in a way. And here is the actual amiibo. And she is stunning. And as promised, she does have a little black speck on her cheek. Cheek, chin. Her eyes came out very good. That's a great feat for a humanoid character because they haven't been able to do that with a lot of the Fire Emblem ones. But anyway, here are the details on her hand. Come on. Focus for me. Focus. Always have trouble focusing on little tiny, tiny figures. But as you can see, she is very detailed and yeah. She might be giving Captain Falcon a run for his money as far as a butt. <laughs> well, best amiibo butt. <laughs> Here are her Bayonetta-like shoes. I guess since Bayonetta wasn't in the game, they decided to give her some new functional boots. And as you can see, they gave her this milky pedestal right there instead of making it like transparent. I don't know why they don't just make all of them transparent. But at least it's not yellow. Her hand in this gun is one piece. Which I kind of don't like that much. <clears throat> it's okay, but whatever. But yeah, you can see that detail on the front of her seat. Nice ponytail. Ponytail wrap. And that's about that. I like her. They did a good job. I mean, the paint down here is a little bit sloppy, but your figure might not look like mine, so. Oh, well, I didn't do a close up on this hand right here, if I can. Come on. It looks like she's wearing some type of bracelet. That might have some type of function. Let's see if she has one on this side, too. She does. Let's get her next to you regular Samus and then close this out. Here they are together and as you can see regular Sam Samus isn't too much taller than Zero Suit. My Samus is tilting a little bit. I did have her in a bag recently so maybe she got slanted. So <laughs> probably gonna have to fix that but yeah. Unless I'm crazy this little base right there the gold looks a little bit darker on hers than Zero Suit but it's nothing too much to compare besides their height and size because they have totally different detailing. Like the gun is even a different color than her suit. But anyway, yeah, I like her. And if you want all the Smash Brothers Amiibo, you're going to have to get her anyway. So <laughs> it, it kind of makes the decision for, for you. And of course, she has function in Super Mario Maker which I haven't got yet, but there's that. Anyway, if you like this close look at Zero Suit Samus, give me a like, share, comment, subscribe if you haven't already done that. T-Man978, out of here. Who has the best booty? You tell me.